gas-powered cars may still dominate the streets for now. But make no mistake, their time is nearly over. Countries across the globe are setting firm deadlines to phase them out completely. Once these bans are active, their era will be done. And leading this transformation is Tesla. Whether you are a fan or a critic, there's no denying Tesla has defined the electric vehicle space from day one. But what truly matters is that Tesla has no intention of slowing down. Based on leaks, public statements, investor briefings, and internal updates, the long-awaited Tesla Model 2 has finalized its structure and is moving towards mass production, aiming for release before the end of this year. Before we continue, welcome to Amp Drive. We are thrilled to have you here, make sure to subscribe to Amp Drive and tap the bell icon. That way, you will never miss out on our upcoming videos that dive deep into Tesla's incredible journey. Now back to the Model 2. Let's be clear, it will not be a completely new concept as some had expected. Instead, what we are getting is a smartly redesigned Model Y, enriched with the finest aspects of the Model 3 and carrying slight design hints from the futuristic Cybertruck. And what Tesla delivers in return is a $15,990 electric car that learns your daily commute patterns and, in the near future, could even drive itself to your location automatically. So, what exactly comes with the highly anticipated Model 2? Can a $15,990 electric car truly offer practicality and dependability? Up to now, Tesla's most daring and disruptive car is no longer the Model Y, Model 3, or any other widely known variant. While it's clear the Model Y has been Tesla's most adaptable vehicle and the company's top-performing SUV, even that model cannot sustain Tesla's momentum forever. Its price tag, starting around $37,000 including available federal incentives, makes it more attainable than luxury vehicles, yet still beyond the reach of many. Tesla's profits and overall revenue have declined sharply this year. Elon Musk has only one viable way forward, introducing the Model 2, a car that millions have been hoping for because it is the only Tesla they could realistically afford. But here's the question, why the delay? Musk has mentioned a $25,000 electric vehicle since the year 2020. Still, the wait continues. The reality is that creating an affordable electric vehicle is far more challenging than it seems. The biggest hurdle? Batteries. Batteries still account for around 30 to 40 percent of an electric vehicle's total cost. And until now, they have depended heavily on lithium. Tesla has been using both lithium iron phosphate and nickel manganese cobalt battery chemistries for years. These battery types have proven dependable and efficient, but they are costly. Lithium costs have gone up significantly, and the global supply chain is stretched more than ever. Over the past 12 months, Tesla has been quietly developing a new battery framework, not just to improve performance but to significantly cut costs. Their aim is no longer to make the finest car money can buy. Instead, it is to make the best electric car that most people can afford. We will talk more about this new battery system powering the Model 2 later in this video. But let's get one thing straight, the Model 2 will not be a cheap, basic electric car. And it definitely won't resemble a glorified golf cart. Everything we have learned so far indicates this will be a capable electric vehicle, built with the same engineering foundation as the Model 3 and Model Y. Just think of it as smaller, cheaper, and meant for daily use. Picture a compact hatchback that's easy to drive in city traffic, the next generation urban vehicle. When looking at Tesla's lineup, it's obvious Elon Musk has already covered most major categories sedans, crossovers, pickups, and even heavy-duty trucks. But one gap has always stood out, a compact hatchback. The Model 2 is the missing piece that could complete that set. Tesla, however, is going with a smarter strategy. Instead of launching a traditional hatchback, they are shaping the Model 2 into a subcompact crossover, smaller than the Model Y. Initially, Production will start at Giga Texas with a goal of up to 10,000 vehicles each week, sharing assembly lines with the Model Y. This makes the Model 2 look like a shrunken down version of the Model Y, Giga casting will be a critical part of producing large volumes efficiently. Tesla is known for being secretive about new models, 
and this one is no different. We still lack precise specifications or full images. Beyond knowing that it is a compact crossover, anything more about the outside look is still speculation. However, what is confirmed by Elon Musk and reliable insiders is that the Model 2 will use an existing platform, which tells us a great deal. This means it will continue Tesla's familiar design patterns. The Model 2 appears to be a minimized version of the Model Y, and that makes total sense. Right now, the crossover market is growing rapidly. So launching a smaller, cheaper Model Y-like vehicle could be a brilliant move. Due to its smaller size, expect scaled-down design elements, slimmer headlights, compact front and rear body panels, and a tighter overall shape. Tesla will use cost-effective parts instead of the higher-end components found in the Model Y. But this is not a downgrade. Tesla is known for producing beautiful, minimalist vehicles. Expect something sleek, fresh, and sporty. Easily among the most eye-catching EVs in its price category. The simplified design is not a shortcut, it's Tesla fully committing to make the $25,000 target price possible. Take a closer look and you'll see this design philosophy applies to all Tesla models, including the premium Model S and Model X, both of which avoid unnecessary complexity. And to be honest, most people interested in the Model 2 care more about value and function than flashy appearance. Even if the design is simple, people will be eager to own a Tesla for $25,000. Interestingly, reports have suggested the Model 2 could come in two different body types, a hatchback and a crossover. This is entirely plausible. While the crossover model is more widely confirmed, the hatchback rumor began with early leaks around Tesla's budget car program. One leaked photo showed a small vehicle with tight proportions, clearly hinting at a hatchback for urban driving. And since Tesla still does not offer a hatchback, it only strengthens the possibility. Hatchbacks are more affordable to build and very popular in places like China and Europe. If Tesla chooses to make both styles, they would likely share about 80% of their parts and ride on the same platform. Just as the Model 3 and Model Y share much of their structure, the Model 2 hatchback and crossover would follow a similar path. One architecture, two versions. More importantly, the Model 2 will be built at a scale never seen before in Tesla's history. Elon Musk himself has said this new car will be manufactured in extremely high volumes and the production techniques used will be unlike anything people have seen. These are not exaggerations. Tesla plans to make millions of these vehicles. Internal reports suggest they aim to produce 10,000 units weekly. Production will begin at Giga Texas and then spread to Giga Shanghai and possibly Giga Berlin. When can we expect the $15,990 version? According to battery experts and supply chain analysts, Tesla is targeting a production cost of $16,000 to $18,000 per unit. This would allow them to sell the vehicle for around $25,000. The key to this cost-saving breakthrough? A battery chemistry known as lithium manganese iron phosphate, or LMFP. This is not science fiction. LMFP has already been used by Chinese manufacturers like BYD. It is cheaper than lithium iron phosphate, avoids expensive nickel or cobalt, and it is more stable. Although LMFP batteries used to have lower energy density, recent improvements have brought them close to current standards. Tesla is reportedly testing LMFP batteries that not only perform well but also charge faster and last longer. If adopted, these could cut battery costs by as much as 30%. Still, battery chemistry is only part of the solution. Tesla is also using structural battery packs, turning the battery itself into the main body structure. This approach cuts extra material, reduces vehicle weight, simplifies the build, and boosts safety. Add Tesla's revolutionary Giga Casting, where large underbody parts are made using a single high-pressure mold, and you get a process that is fast, efficient, and cost-effective. This method reduces the number of components, cuts production time, and slashes expenses. Right now, Giga Texas uses a 6,000-ton press for the Model Y and a 9,000-ton version for the Cybertruck. The Model 2 will follow a similar production method. Without this tech, 
reaching the $25,000 goal might not even be possible. This all started when Elon Musk got inspired by a Hot Wheels toy car and asked why entire car sections couldn't be cast as one piece. That vision became reality through a partnership with an Italian firm that built the Giga Press. When Reuters reported Tesla's plans to produce 500,000 Model 2 vehicles annually, it lined up with Musk's earlier statements about very high production volumes. Tesla has confirmed that pilot production for this next-gen vehicle has already started and is running on current production lines with only small changes needed. This speeds up the entire process and keeps costs under control. Based on data from Tesla's global factories, Giga Shanghai is most likely the lead facility producing the first Model 2 units. That factory is now capable of building a Model Y every 40 seconds. As the world's most efficient plant, it gives Tesla a huge advantage in cost and scale. Once Tesla finalizes the Model 2 production in Asia, it could expand to the United States next, with the Fremont facility being a strong candidate. Gigafactory Berlin remains uncertain due to higher wages in Europe, which could reduce Tesla's ability to keep prices low. However, Tesla has other strategies to reduce costs. What if Tesla deploys Optimus robots to build the Model 2? That is not a far-off idea. Elon Musk recently shared that over 1,000 Tesla bots will be working in factories by year-end. Hundreds are already doing basic jobs at Giga Texas and Giga Shanghai. These humanoid robots may soon take over simple tasks on the Model 2 production line. Musk dreams of a fully automated factory where bots and humans work together. Optimus could do things like bolt tightening, quality checks, or painting tasks with more accuracy and without needing breaks. This could slash labor costs and speed up production, especially for a vehicle meant to be produced in the millions. If Tesla succeeds, Model 2 might become the first affordable electric car built with help from humanoid robots. Elon Musk recently confirmed plans to scale Optimus to between 500,000 and 1 million units per year by 2026. With that level of automation, the future of electric vehicles and robotics might arrive sooner than expected. What do you think about Optimus bots helping build the Tesla Model 2? Is it a great step forward or a risk to jobs? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video and want more updates about Tesla cars and robots, make sure to hit the like button and share this video. And please do not forget to subscribe to Amp Drive so you can stay up to date with all our future content. Thanks for being with us. See you next time.